Hey everybody, Steven here. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to create an anchor link with DiviTeam. Now, if you don't know what an anchor link is, it's just a way to link to a certain part of the page without having to go to a separate page every time. Now, let's jump right into WordPress and I will show you guys how this works. As you can see, guys, I'm logged into my WordPress right here. Uh, the first thing we want to do is to visit site. And uh, this is my home page right here. And on this page, what I want to do is when somebody click on this get started button right here, when you click on this get started button right here, it will scroll you down to this section of the page. So how do we do that? I will show you. So the first thing we do is um, enable the visual builder. So now that we're in the visual builder, we want to scroll down and find a section that we want to link a specific button or a text to. So let's say we, let's say for example, we want to link these offers and details to a specific section on the page. So what we do now, we scroll down and find that section of the page. So let's say we want to link that to, um, maybe this section that say what you get. So what you do is you hover over this what you get and this little icon here, the setting icon, you just click on it and go on the advanced tab and under the CSS ID and classes, you see CSS ID. Just give, let's give this section a, a CSS ID name. So for this section, I will just call it what you get. Uh, guys also make sure that there is no space between the uh id so don't put space between what you get so make sure everything is all together if not uh the link will not work so let, let's save this let's scroll up to uh this section let's 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 add the link to this offers and details so what you do hover over these offers and details now because we want to link these details to that what you get section instead of going to the advanced tab we go to link so what you want to do is uh, put the same id that we that we created earlier which is what you get but make sure you put a hashtag in front of the id so I'm going to put a hashtag in front of the ID just like this and save it. And now let's save this and exit the visual builder. You can see that it's saving right here. It's saved. Now let's exit the visual builder. So here you can see that the offers and details and is now a link. So if I click on it, it will scroll me down to this section. That's it guys. It's really that simple. This is how you create an anchor link on your website. So guys, if you like this video, please subscribe to the channel and don't forget to hit that notification bell and I will see you next time.